Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new and today we are doing a build. This is going to be a live build, not a speed build. I've seen a lot of people doing this challenge right now and it looks fun, so I'm gonna give it a try. So this is gonna be the Every Room is a Different Pack Challenge. Uh, I'm sure you guys have seen this floating around right now and it's going to be really hard for someone who uses a lot of CC in her builds, but uh, I think we can get through it. Like I said in my last build, I'm not that good at building shells, so I just found one on the gallery. And that's what we're gonna be basing um, basing our build off of today. I already placed it and everything, so we're just gonna be furnishing. And we're going to be using James Turner's pack randomizer to randomize our packs for us. So yeah, I'm really excited to get into this. I'm really excited to see how the build is going to turn out. So let's get into it. <laughs> All right, guys, so this is the shell that I found on the gallery. We actually have to delete these trees, huh? Uh, let me show you exactly what shell it is. Okay, it's this one right here called Daisy Shell 3 by <sighs> Chai Tea Cutie. That's so adorable. I really like the look of this house. Um, so I just placed it and I removed absolutely everything <laughs> so that we just have a shell. There's nothing on the inside either. I took out all of the doors, the wallpaper, the flooring. <laughs> every single thing so it can be a fair challenge. Okay, so this is the random pack generator that I'm gonna be using. It's on James Turner's uh, website. So basically, the first one we're going to be doing, or no, if you guys haven't watched a video like this, basically you randomize a pack for every room of the house uh, and that's the only pack that you can use while furnishing. So this first one is going to be for the outside, the windows, the front door, the pathways, the fences, all that kind of stuff. So, and if um, if the pack that you get doesn't have an item that you need, you use base game. So this should be interesting too, because I've been wanting to do a base game only build as well. Uh, honestly, I don't think I'm that great of a builder without CC, but I guess we'll see what happens. <laughs> so this pack is going to be for the outside. Here we go. Fitness stuff for the outside. Okay, sure. <laughs> I have a feeling we're gonna be using a lot of base game. All right, let's see what windows come in this pack, shall we? Fitness, 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 fitness. I actually really like this pack and I like all the stuff that came with it. Uh, no results found. Oh, okay, so there's like really tall windows. So it looks like we're gonna have to, um, we have to make the walls tall, or the, okay. Yeah, and okay. So, mm -hmm. it's going to be a very modern house on the outside, which I'm okay with. I never really know what to say when I'm live building. <laughs> That's why I don't really do a lot of these types of videos, just because like I have brain farts on what I want to say. Um, but that's okay, we'll, we'll work it out. I can't believe we only have one window to work with. At least it's like a decent window. Oh, and it comes in different swatches. <gasps> we might have to change the swatch later, depending on the uh, wallpaper. Let's see what kind of wallpaper fitness stuff has. No wallpaper. Oh, 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 okay, cool. <gasps> I could work with this, you guys. I could definitely work with this. I'm thinking maybe we should do like a, I wanna make it super modern on the outside. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna use this, uh, this like thin brick for all of the parts that protrude. You know what I mean? Like that part. And then we can do, let's do this part. So we have like a spot in the back that's dark. Um, I think that's good. So let's see what color of this wave stone looks good with the black. Ah, there we go. Okay. Um, you know, with the windows, I think that looks kind of cool. Or maybe the white. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Yeah. See, this one, it's not really white. It's more of like a brownish gray, so that works out nicely. This house is gonna be so nice and modern on the outside, and then when you go on the inside, it's just gonna be like this cluster of just disgustingness. <laughs> I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Okay, so let's see what kind of doors we got. 
Oh, yay, there's a matching door. If I'm being honest, I've never used these windows and I've never used this door before either. So I'm quite excited to finally be using them. Stepping out of my comfort zone. I wonder, should we make the walls the tallest and like mishmash the different windows? Huh, that's interesting. Don't know if I like it though. Okay, there we go. And then we definitely need a uh, black roof for sure. It has to be base game though. Should we do the metal roof? It matches the modern vibe of the home. What about this one? Oh, I have one new follower. Wow. Ooh, that's nice. I like that a lot. And it looks like there's a roof trim. I wonder what it would look like with the super thick one. I love the super thick roof trim. Okay, and then let's see what we got as far as flooring goes. Really? Fitness stuff didn't come with any flooring. Wow. Uh, okay, well, let's do base game then. See if there's some nice stonage we can use. Okay, let's just do that one. And then let's just do that for the foundation. This is actually pretty cool. Like if you don't know what kind of house you wanna build, just have a pack decide for you because I had no idea we were gonna be building a modern home today. <laughs> okay, let's see what kind of fences there are in the fitness pack. Really, there's no fences. Okay, base game it is. I don't hate it. I actually kind of like it, but let's have a look at it in black. That's looking quite nice. Well, the fitness pack didn't come with any plants, no columns, no window accents. I gotta say, it's been really hard making that transition from building in The Sims to building in Animal Crossing just because you have so much freedom while building in The Sims, but with Animal Crossing, you have like no freedom whatsoever. It's very um, limited and it's really frustrating. So it feels really good to be building in The Sims again. All right, well, you guys get the vibe that I'm going for for the outside. I think we'll probably finish furnishing it once we're done with everything else. Okay, so let's move on to the first area. The first one we're gonna be doing is the living room. So let's randomize another pack for that. Here we go. I'm nervous. This is like a very important one. Tiny living? Oh my God, that's amazing. That's amazing, that's amazing, that's amazing. All right, get out of here fitness stuff. We don't need you anymore. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw some base game lights just so I can see what I'm doing. All right, tiny living, let's see what you got. So I'm just gonna grab pretty much everything that we could possibly use. Rug, a mirror, perfection, a picture, um, and a bookcase. Okay, so this is everything, right? Everything from tiny living. Ooh, ooh, and we got some lamps. Heck yeah. Ooh, ooh, and this, whatever that is. I could definitely work with this. All right, so for the little walkway, we need like a, uh, like a little table that you can throw stuff on. I think maybe we can still keep it modern so far, which I'm pretty excited about, but let's see the colorways first. Black, we could do black. I actually really like this, it's super cute. Oh, and it comes in black, you guys. Yes. <laughs> um, right. So I'm thinking maybe, oh, there is a door for tiny living. Hmm. Maybe we should just do a base game door though. I kind of just want to do a walkway. Yeah, something like that, that goes into the kitchen. We can have the TV thing be here. We can put bookcases on either side of it maybe. You know what? I actually think I like this big one better. It just flows. Um, but there's no TV, which kind of sucks, but can we just grab one from base game? Is that allowed? <laughs> yeah, see? Just pop it there, just like that. Okay, and then let's see what colorways we have for this couch. I'm a little bit nervous. I'm very scared. I don't want bright colors. I have a theme going on here. Oh my god, look at that. Neutral colorway. But I actually like this. It matches with that. 
So we gonna go with that. Okay, there. It took me absolutely forever to figure out the layout of this living room. I finally figured it out. All right, which rug though? I don't mm. It looks decent. Do you just want to do the gray? Keep it more modern. The more modern, the better. <laughs> Actually, hold on. Don't delete that chair. Let's put it over here by this um, table. And then this thing. Uh, I guess we could just... Shoot, I have no use for this, so we're just gonna sell it. Put the mirror there above the little side table. And then, what was on this side? I hate how I can't freaking see anything. Oh, that's for the kitchen. Definitely for the kitchen. All right, so I sell that then. Oh, these are really cute pictures. Yeah, that's great. I love that so much. I'm gonna put more over here, actually. <laughs> oh, there's this. I'm just gonna stack some of these over here. Put another one of those and what else? Maybe another lamp. And <laughs> um, I think that's good enough, actually. Maybe we should get rid of the lamp then. This looks a little big on here, though. All right, we'll just put another book thing. There are so many, oh my God, that looks ridiculous. There are so many of those book things in there. There's no flooring for tiny living and no wallpaper? Why not? That just seems strange to me. All right, guys, there is our tiny living entryway and living room. Uh, so let's do, what should we do next? Should we do the kitchen next? I'm scared, I'm really scared, but let's do it, let's, let's just, do it like a band-aid. Generate. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. To toddler stuff. Is that a joke? How am I supposed to build a kitchen with freaking toddler stuff? Oh my god, this is all that came with it. I guess we're doing a base game kitchen, which I'm okay with, but like, that really sucks. We got really unlucky with that one. Well, I guess we could base the kitchen off one of these rugs. So it's like at least toddler stuff themed. I don't know. Maybe one of these rugs? It's so huge. Let's just size it down. Oh god. <sighs> okay, base game it is. Here are my counter options. Uh, definitely not that one. No. Dang it, but it's so modern and it would work. Oh, we got such crap luck. I just realized I don't like base game very much. Kitchen is gargantuan. I'm thinking that this probably wasn't the kitchen when the creator made it. <laughs> oh well, I have no idea what I'm doing. Did, uh... No, it didn't have bar stools, so I have to do base game again. Okay, let's see if this pack had any uh, flooring or wallpaper. I'm really scared. It's probably going to be extremely bright and just not kitchen, kitchen worthy. Wow, no wallpaper, no floor. This sucks. I don't even want to do this kitchen anymore. It's just super boring. Okay, there we go. A very plain and boring kitchen. Okay, so um, we have the dining room here. So let's go ahead and do another pack. Dining room, dining room, give me something good. Strangerville. Lovely. Okay, well, first and foremost... Sorry, my dogs bark every time they get fed. Okay, so here we have the doors for Strangerville. Uh, oh my god, okay. Mmm, that'll have to work, I guess. <laughs> Let's see what there is as far as wallpaper goes. Oh my god, you guys. Oh, I mean, it could work. If we do something like super modern and industrial, you know what I mean? Let's see what there is for floors. Okay, yeah. Ugh. Oh, it's horrible. Oh my god, it's horrible. Oh god, it's horrible. <laughs> 
The black swatch is definitely the best because you can't really see the, the, the design that much. Um, okay, let's see what there is as far as dining table. No dining table, so that's good. Any dining chairs? No. What about decor? Right. That's custom, so I can't use that. So there's just this poster and this picture. <sighs> oh, there's a bar. Should we use it? <laughs> I want to cry. I want to freaking cry. This looks like a chef's hat chair. <laughs> there's a rug. Oh, there's this. Here's a lamp we can use. Love lamp. Our dining room is slowly looking like a, uh, a, uh, like a retro bar, isn't it? <laughs> Ouch. Okay. Well, oh, I love these swatches of this rug, actually. I use this rug a lot. Seems to be a lot of blue accents, so I guess we could just do blue. You guys, this is bad. This is really, really bad. Hopefully there's a decent base game table that we can work with. I have to weed through all of my custom content, and it's quite annoying. Alright, there's our dining table. <sighs> these chairs kind of match with the vibe, so uh, I guess we'll use these. This is so not my normal style of building. <laughs> but at least everything goes together. At least it's uh, cohesive. Does this come in a blue? It does. Let's do the rusty blue. Might as well take full advantage, am I right? Oh my god, this is hands down the cringiest thing I've ever seen in my life. With the freaking fitness pack window. Ugh, I want to barf. I want to barf! <laughs> oh, okay. Master bedroom. Okay, enough of this nonsense. Give me something good. You screwed me for the past two. Oh my god, cleaning out stuff. Is there even a bed in that one? Ugh! All right, I'm getting a headache. No wallpapers, great. No floors, even better. Okay, let's see what we got. We got little pom-poms, we got a chair. We got a little seat, a table. Ooh, I love these little hanging things. Oh, finally some plants. This is gonna be a very groovy bedroom, I'll tell you that. Oh, we got a bunch of movie posters as well. Okay, this pack isn't that bad. Oh, we have curtains and everything. Oh my goodness. I feel spoiled. Oh my gosh, and a dresser. And a popcorn machine. <laughs> okay, uh, well, hmm. Let's find a bed that matches this pack at least, and let's place that first. Okay, I found kind of a funky yellow bed. It's base game, but it is like a locked one, but who cares, who cares, who cares, who cares? We're using it, we're using it. I love the yellow swatch. So let's stick it against the wall there. Or should we have it here? Because the window... It could be a single parent, and they could have their bed smushed up against the wall. Why not? Or we could just delete this window since there's already one in here. Okay, let's do that, and then we can put the wardrobe right here. Maybe? Hmm. Alright, and then the chair. <sighs> well, it's not turning out as bad as I thought it was going to, so that's good. <laughs> Uh, I know that there is a chair that came with movie stuff pack. I can put it at the desk. I'm gonna grab a computer from base game. Is there a laptop in base game? If so, I think that would be super vibey. Oh, there is. Ba-boom. Shalom. Ooh, and it comes in fun colors. Oh. <gasps> Perfecto. All right, uh, what do we have on the wall here? I guess we'll do a, a sort of gallery wall, if you will. Boom and boom. Oh wait, we need to put a door there. Okay, there, all right, now let's see what kind of, like what we're working with for wallpaper and floors. Man, why doesn't anything come with wallpaper? 
That's so annoying. Hey, and there's her gallery wall of movie posters. And now, did this pack come with the door? It did, okay. So we'll go with the white one for sure. It's not gonna look good from the living room, but whatever. <laughs> it is what it is. Oh wait, I forgot a rug. Did this pack even come with the rug? It did. Well, it does help that uh, this um, house is um, split up. It's not like an open floor plan, so it doesn't look too weird because everything is just sectioned off nicely. So that's one thing we got going for us. Oh, and I forgot we need a door for the bathroom. I guess we can do the second bedroom now. Uh, this will either be a teen bedroom or a child's bedroom. I guess it depends on the pack we get. <laughs> I'm getting tired. Tiny living stuff again. You can't do um two. Well, uh, you can't do one two times. Vintage glamour stuff. Oh, okay. This is good. This is good. I was thinking the luxury party stuff pack. Okay. Well, this this isn't too bad. There's a lot of good stuff. Maybe this can be the master bedroom then, and that could be like a teenage girl's ma uh, bedroom. Okay. Cool. You know what? <laughs> This pack has so many weird swatches that I never use, so I'm thinking maybe we should take advantage of it and make it just like the most gaudy bedroom you have ever seen in your entire life. See what I mean about like the swatches that like people will probably never use? We're gonna go for it. All right, we got our end tables. We got our little bar cart we can put here in the corner. Um, ooh, yes, vanities. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. And we got curtains and everything. Oh my god, these are so, so just out there. Ooh, yes, queen, a fireplace. We need a fireplace. This bedroom is rather tight, isn't it? Just put that there, maybe? Or in this corner, perhaps? Sure. Nice fuzzy rug. Yeah, we could just put these in the bathroom, actually. It'll be like a little closet. This bedroom is definitely not my cup of tea, y'all. Like, not even a little bit. <laughs> Feels good to use the stuff though. Oh, I love these pictures. They're so awesome. I know this is Aubrey Hepburn. I know the middle one is Marilyn Monroe. I don't know who that is though. Don't shoot me. All right, is there any? <gasps> there is, oh, thank God, thank God. I was so bored of using base game. Oh, so cute. I'm actually loving this bedroom. I didn't think I would, but I do. I like it a lot. No flooring though. Okay, that's fine. Hmm, what should this other room be? I kind of just want this to be a two bedroom house because it's a little small. So I guess it could be like a study. I'm not missing anything, right? Living room, dining room, kitchen. <laughs> uh, okay, let's do a study. Give me something good. Give me like parenthood or something. No, not again. That's not happening. Yes! Yes! That's the kind of energy I need right now. All right. A season's study. So it's going to be like computer, all that good stuff. I love this desk so much. One of my favorite desks in the whole game for sure. I really want to put one of these in, so I think we're gonna have to do that. Alrighty, so I don't know how to build a wall that fits around this thing. <laughs> there we go, perfect! My favorite swatch um, in Seasons is definitely this one with the purple tint. I just think it's gorgeous. Hmm. Now I'm not liking the swatch of this desk, so let's switch it to match. Um, let's do that one. We can put this bad boy right here in front of the window so it gets enough sun to grow. Should we do the purple avocado rug? I find this rug really interesting. 
but I never use it. I like it, it's too vibrant, that's why. Put some of these trophies here. Uh, it could be like a trophy display case. <clears throat> what else? How about one of these lovely bunches? I think that's good enough for a study. I like the way it looks. All right, let's see what wallpapers we got. Okay, some paneling. Well, it definitely feels like a den or a study, doesn't it? <laughs> and flooring, nothing, nothing. Oh my God, okay. Fine, fine, fine. We'll just do this one. I love this floor. Oh, right, we need a computer. Base game computer it is. All right, guys, here is our finished study. <sighs> the last thing that we need to do is the bathrooms, and honestly, I'm dreading it. So let's start with, oh shoot, we used some of the Vengeance Glamour stuff in this bathroom. Can't do that. All right, this is for bathroom number one, the master bath. Can't do fitness stuff again. I wish, because I love the bathroom fitness stuff. Dude, give me something different. Oh my god. Kids room stuff. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna do this bathroom since this could be like a kid's bedroom or a teenager's bedroom. Okay, so uh, I found some, uh, this is cute. I'm gonna use this. This is from the kids room stuff just to kind of um, section off the toilet a little bit. And then I just use base game uh, stuff for the other things. There's probably no wallpaper or flooring for this pack. I've gotten so unlucky with that. Oh, how cute is this? We can definitely use that. I'm obsessed with that. We could pretend like it's a trash can. Oh, what if we centered the mirror in between these two butterfly things? Aww. This is like such a goals room for a little girl. Let's just do a double sink so it's nice and symmetrical. Uh, what else we got? What else? What else? What else? Cute lights we can use. Okay, moving on to the... I guess this would be the guest bath- guest bathroom? Here we go. I'm not expecting anything good. You serious? Oh my god, okay. <laughs> A jungle adventure bathroom. Interesting. We got some nice shelves, which I can appreciate. Uh, oh my god, we have- oh yes, these are like some of my favorite counters. Oh, and a shower, and a sink. Yes, queen, give it to me. This was actually a good pack to get. So we got a sink, and a shower, and a bath, but no toilet. Hmm, that makes sense. Actually, there is a toilet. <laughs> But there's no way I'm using that. I am sorry, but there's absolutely no way. And if you think I'm a cheater, then so be it. All right, let's see what doors we got. Not my first choice, not by a long shot. They're all so huge. Why do you have to be so large? Any wallpaper in Jungle Adventure? There is, oh my God, there's tile. Wow, I feel blessed and concrete oh that's gorgeous i'm in love i'm in love i'm in love i'm in love yes why have i never used this tile before it's gorgeous okay we definitely need curtains i had to take out this window in the middle because it just wasn't looking right mm -hmm. we're gonna have to use base game okay gang and last but not least we have the master bathroom. Here we go. I'm so tired. This is taking me so long. <laughs> backyard stuff. <laughs> of course, backyard stuff. Duh. What a, I mean, I mean, it couldn't have given me something good, right? Backyard stuff for a freaking bathroom. Deep breaths. It'll all be okay. So this is all I got to work with. Okay. Well, at least there's a nice rug. A nice rug, a cute little lantern. 
Did backyard stuff have any plants? I don't think it did. Oh, it does. These work. Just wedge it in the corner there. Oh, I actually like that. Okay. All is not lost. All right, there's the bathroom finished and we are officially done. So since I got fitness stuff for the outside, I'm just adding some of this workout gear to the back because why not? Maybe the person who lives here is super into fitness. I don't know. I don't freaking know. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I'm getting frustrated with this challenge. Oh, we can put some of these cute, um, cute little chairs out here. Maybe they could be like for like tanning or some, maybe a rock climbing wall. Super bougie. Look, you even got the correct um, scenery to make it feel like you're actually climbing a, wall, a rock wall. <laughs> okay, I think I need to stop. All right, I'm done. I'll show you the screenshots now. Thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, I know this wasn't the best build. I know, I know, and I'm real sorry, but I really wanted to try this challenge for myself. And I'm glad that I did. Let me know if you want me to upload this to, ga to, the, to, 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 to the gallery. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye.